You cannot swim across the English Channel in 5 minutes. You can in no way paint the Mona Lisa in 5 minutes. And you absolutely cannot go back in time and make your parents fall in love in 5 minutes. But you can do something equally amazing in guess what? Just 5 minutes. Make your websites even more engaging with the Lorify app for Webflow. In this video, we will begin by learning how to install the Lottie Files app. After that, we can look into how to search and insert Lottie animations that are available on our Lottie Files marketplace. Later, we can talk about how to customize these animations so that they can match our design theme. And lastly, we will also cover how to insert animations that are saved on our Lottie Files workspace. So let's begin by installing the Lottie Files app. Just navigate to marketplace and choose apps. Over here, click on the Lottie files for Webflow and hit install app. You can either choose the sites that you want to authorize the app for or simply choose your entire workspace. And click on the authorize app button. Now let's go back to our site. and navigate to apps to open the lorry files app just click on the launch button over here once you have your app up and running let us proceed by inserting a lorry animation into our web layout i already have my layout ready and my containers all set up once you do that all you have to do is simply search for what you want Choose what you like and click on insert animation. In the settings menu, make sure you check the loop button so your animation plays continuously. Over here, I'm just adjusting the size and playing around with the spacing of my animation. Click on the navigator to ensure that you have placed your animation in the right container. Now let's look for some more animations that we can add to our services section. Now although this animation does look great, it doesn't really match our website's theme. So let's look at how we can customize it. Just click on the color palette option here. You can either choose an existing palette or create a new one by clicking on the new palette button. Choose the color you want or simply paste the hex code of your brand color. Once that's done, just save and insert your animation. And done. This is what it looks like in your web design. For the next icon, I want to add in an animation that I had previously worked on which is saved in my Lotty Files workspace. To access that, just head over to the workspace tab and navigate through your folders to find the animation that you'd like to work with. Just select it and click insert. Let's add in three more animations to complete our design. Lastly, I just want to add one more animation and this time I want it to be the background of my hero section. So once again, I'm going to pull up an animation from my workspace and place it in the body container. And that's all. As promised, we went from this to this in just 5 minutes.